it always starts with the consumer. So there's no surprise that the path to purchase funnel is not linear anymore, and it's more complex. Consumers now have access to more information in more places, and they actually have more control of the buying process than they have in the past. And so that simple linear purchase funnel doesn't exist anymore. Consumers don't go from discover to shop to buy to repeat. It's more complex because consumers are more interconnected in every point of the journey. And as us as marketers, we need to really understand those connectivity points and really how do we know what's driving our business and how do we have that ability to measure. The goal of our media campaigns really should be delivering the most relevant message at the most relevant time to the best person. And let's be honest, it's not as easy said as done, right? <laughs> it is very difficult and there's not always that clear path for that to actually happen. But having a structure and a framework for you and your business is important because it really helps you have a focus to really deliver that end result, which for us is purchase. The importance of who the consumer is is so important and we really need to focus our attention on the consumer before you start developing your brand message. They should be the source of our inspiration and growth because it's not going after just that right consumer anymore. It's really about creating some meaningful insights so then we can actually target them and measure them. The ability now, if you take this type of approach, is you don't have one big consumer bucket anymore. You may have a lovely five to 10 different consumer segments, and that's okay, but you actually really need to actually understand who they are and how you're gonna deliver that right message to them. IRI can connect all those dots for you. We can look across media channels in the paid, owned, and earned space, as well as incorporate in-store elements into the, the overall platform so you know which variables are working for you. IRI has 150 million cards in which we can understand what the true purchase intent is of, or true purchase behavior of consumers is. And so we can connect that back to exposures. And how we do this is it complex pr process. There's many different channels. You know, there's a control group, but of the individuals who purchase, we have to understand what they purchased, when they purchased, and how much they purchased. We first want to make sure that we always dig deeper. We don't ignore that amplification process, and we understand how that amplification process works along with our purchase-based targeting. So I have a challenge to everybody here. It's never, ever too late to do some of these things right now on your media plan. So as you kind of go away, the first thing I would think about, like, what are my media plans right now? And is there any way that I can enhance those, even through the targeting? You can do that during any time of your campaign. Know who you're targeting. Asking the right questions of your suppliers for your audiences is very important. And really understand that you can get that holistic and understand that whole true experience going forward. So measure what matters. Benchmark the results for the bigger picture and always align your organization top down across through with agencies with your ad tech partners as well.